Hi, James West here from Climate Desk. The warmest 10 years on record have been in the last 15 years here in the continental US, but nothing beats 2012. And as climate change reporters, it's been a massive year for Climate Desk. The West is a tinderbox. The Colorado wildfires devastated people's lives and cost at least half a billion dollars. If this doesn't tell us that now's the time for the debate, I guess nothing will. Rest in peace, little house. An epic drought, the worst in 60 years, covering at least two thirds of the continental US. He said, I've never been to the moon, but I'll bet it looks like this. And costing at least $150 billion and counting. 98 degrees and no wind. Nobody has hay. Neither does North Dakota or South Dakota or Kansas or Oklahoma or west of Wyoming and Montana. Complete and utter devastation of Breezy Point community. Unbelievable. And one devastating superstorm called Sandy, which crippled the nation's biggest city. Come right in. My back deck floated away. I'll tell you, the response of the people in the neighborhood are just amazing. The church and PTAs and Girl Scouts and Boy Scouts. Coastline's changing. Something's not right. <laughs> okay. This storm was not supposed to be here. And it is. 2012 trained our reporting on how to feed and how to power a warming world. The fuel, as we can see, is just coming right at us. This will give us more energy independence. And either you're going to join with them or you're going to be left behind. The question is going to be, can we be smart enough? To bring in a lot more renewables and energy efficiency. And at the 11th hour in a presidential campaign. Climate change is not a hoax. Got you talking about climate change again. Yeah, there's a pattern here. Above all, climate change is about you and your lives. The bathroom's over flooded. It's, I have no water. I depend on my neighbors for water right now. And you've told us your stories and you've told them from the heart. Oh, it's, it's an emotional story. We're collateral damage. It's hard to wrap my mind around that all the time. I think if I did, I'd be crazy. Our awesome partners have offered up some awesome stories about climate change too. And next year, we're still going to give you the front seat in the climate conversation at Climate Desk Live with Chris Mooney. And a reminder, you can always catch up with all of our videos on YouTube. Make sure you subscribe and join the growing conversation on our Facebook page and amongst our dedicated Twitter followers. We're looking forward to bringing you more stories from the Climate Desk next year.